it's Flo and today I want to show you how to install a recovery on your HTC One X then we have to flash this super user access uh, with this recovery and then we will just root our HTC One X so here is my HTC One X and this only thing you must have done before is to unlock the bootloader so thanks to the last alien on XG a, I have been able to, to do that, uh, I already know how to do that, but I have recorded a video for him and uh, just let's go right now to restart my phone. So I have just to uh, to restart it right now, you know, uh, let's go to continue like that, follow, uh, follow, yes, this is French, but I don't need uh, something else, follow. Follow, follow, in your, okay, follow, accept, accept, and I have just uh, reboot after the bootloader, you know, uh, so this is why there is a lot of things to, to do. Okay, so um, first things to, to do is to download two different files. Uh, so these files are uh, the chain fire, this is a super user SU, so you have to get that here. This is uh, CWM Super SU uh, VO94, uh, 914, excuse me. Uh, okay, so clear that. Then we have to download another one. This is the um, official recovery. Okay, so this is recovery clockwork mode. So delete it. Okay, so you have download these two different files, this one and the other one. We have to put the CWM Super SU on your HTC One X. So just plug it in and turn in disk drive like that. Okay. Uh, by the way, we have just to check if the um, if the debugging mode is uh, activated. So yes, I want to activate it. And the power menu, power, and we have just to uncheck fast boot like that. Okay. When it's done. Uh, I think it's cool to go on HTC storage there and create a new folder that you can uh, call here. You can maybe call it ROM and radio. Uh, on this one, you have to create a new one uh, for ROM there and another one, you know, ROM and another one for files. I think on this one, we have to. Um, name 1x so we have to put the cwm super su there on our new uh, folder this is file cwm on files there we have this file on your uh, htc device we have also to keep the recovery clock work touch uh, 584 we have to change maybe the name to be easier so i want to continue to know which one it is and I just want to use uh, recovery 5841x like that you have to put it on, on the uh, Android SDK tools like that so recovery Android SDK uh, tools isn't it haven't I yes I have overalls yes this is here uh, you have to put it there I said and uh, on this file, on this folder, you know, Android SDK tools, where you already have AGB and uh, and other things. So here is my uh, recovery. Now I need to flash it uh, by the fast boot. So uh, let's go to restart my phone on fast boot mode. So you have to uncheck. Uh, no, that we just have to select charge only like that and finish then we have to unplug it and restart on phone our phone on fast boot mode so let's just go to power off like that uh, by the way i will just read it for one second uh tac -tac. connect your phone and let's copy open cmg no get uh, for the do you remember this is uh, button to pack it up to bootloader okay so my phone is just turning off here we have to restart on fastboot, you must already know how to do. Volume done, power, not power, volume done continue, and your phone must start on the bootloader mode. We must go on fastboot, so just select fastboot by power button, and there we have to connect our computer, like that. 
we have to go on the uh, command this one there we have to continue as previously to go on the folder where is located the uh, recovery and the fastboot so let's go to android sdk windows back tools and we must flash the recovery so the command is fastboot flash recovery recovery um, what's the name 58401x.amg like that and it is sending the recovery it's okay writing recovery once again okay and it's done your recovery is now flashed on your comp on your uh, device what we have to do is to um, power down our phone so by the way we have to use the volume button to power down the phone like that when it's done you have to just uh, disconnect our HTC One X and we start on fast boot mode like that on bootloader mode and the recovery is now installed so we can go there to the recovery here and press power to select it and our phone is just restarting on recovery uh, maybe you seen differently than the HTC One S we have no uh, white uh, red uh, things there okay so we have to install um, the zip so we have to select install zip choose zip from SD card and we have to go where we have placed it so ROM radio and we have to go on files and we have to select I just want to show you CM super user SU and select yes install it you have some different lines and we must have install from SD card, uh, SD card complete then we have to go back and reboot system now so we have just installed the recovery and uh, flash the recovery install the super su in less than seven minutes you know and now we have just to root our device so to do that you, we just have to download this application titanium backup root so you have to go on the play store to do that my phone is still there and it is restarting so let's go okay it launched different applications and just let's go wow it's so fast in less than one hour i have just been able to install a custom rom on my htc one x uh, i think this is my my personal best score okay so let's go to enter my pin code like that okay and we have now to go on the play store we have to search uh, yes new account uh, not new account not activate Wi-Fi count we have so you can contact me at this uh, account flowwolf1 at gmail.com and the password is just this one yes okay so let's go to connect okay it can take a few minutes uh, okay no, do not send connection it can take a while okay uh, ignore that and we have to no I don't want okay talk continue okay I have some messaging okay accept the term and conditions we have to download the titanium backup root back up root this one there we have to download titanium backup backup root download it and accept and download this is just so fast the htc one x oh it's just maybe it's uh, hot right now but not too much and it's just so so fast uh, maybe you have seen i have tested some accessories for the htc one x and soon i will receive a new case the no rev case and the brando screen protections i will test two different brando screen protection next week just for you so i hope you will be happy so okay uh, i have done what it then when it's done we have to continue to search that so we have just to uh, you have to 
go to the problem. Okay, once you have a Genelium LED, it's installed. Once that's finished, start the app on your HTC One X and it will ask you for super. Okay, open it. It asks and you have to uh, grant it and it's finished. Genelium uh, backup, okay, and with your derivation. Okay, okay, fuzzy box, okay, MNG card, external storage, okay, so it's uh, it's just done, and our phone is now rooted, so this is cool, <laughs> now I will just show you how to install a custom ROM or, uh, on our HTC One X, so for example, I will start with, uh, I don't know, the Maximus, maybe, thanks to have seen this video, that's flow.